So a lot of people call us and ask if they can just leave their rabbit at home over the weekend. They say, you know, I'm going on a weekend trip with my family. I put out a lot of food and a lot of water. Do you think my rabbit will be okay? And I practically beg them not to do that because one thing about rabbits is that you have about a 12 hour window before a rabbit gets really sick. And if a rabbit, for example, stops eating when you go away in the morning and still isn't eating by that evening, that rabbit should seek vet care, or you should seek vet care for the rabbit sooner rather than later. You can't wait another couple of days. It just doesn't work. And I know Amy travels very frequently for work and has always gotten somebody to stay in her apartment mm -hmm. and, and um, take care of her rabbit when she's gone. Years ago, I worked for a magazine in New York City, and I had a man come and stay in my apartment for every single time I was out of town. That worked out really well. Vets will also board rabbits for you. Uh, sometimes other rabbit owners will board them for you. What you want to be careful about, if you're going to board a rabbit in a vet's office, visit the place where they board animals first. Make sure that there aren't a lot of barking dogs around, that the cage is big enough and comfortable enough for your rabbit. You want your rabbit kept as comfortably as possible. It's not home, but it can right. be a home away from home if it's the right place. But they um, also, they like to be, you know, they like to be around other, they like to be around people. So yeah, yeah. you don't want to leave your bunny alone for the weekend. Yeah, exactly. Social interaction counts for a lot. This is a very social species, and the more social interaction, the better. Mm -hmm. So. So no, you can't leave your bunny alone. Absolutely not. <laughs>